Wow, this will be the freshest chow mein yeah. ever. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone asks me. Is no ball mountain down then problem, sir? Welcome to the last episode of my Himalayan trek. Today I am going to make my way back down. Probably, probably not today. I'm going to spend a couple of days doing it. I'm going to say hello to Goncholden. I'm going to say hello to the master brewer at the Tibet guest house. I'm going to say hello to Jane. I'm actually now probably, st I don't know, I'm just guessing. I'm probably now standing on a graveyard because I assume not everyone was found during that earthquake. This is the, when the earthquake shook uh, this whole valley to its core. Uh, this is the uh, 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 mountain that released a landslide and this is the site of the old Langtang village that was just whisked away basically. Langtang village was one of the most popular trekking destinations in Nepal and home to 435 people. But there is virtually nothing left. It's hard to believe but 55 hotels and guest houses and the villagers homes are gone under this great tongue of ice and rock. So all the houses and everyone that was living here was just instantly. Uh, hundreds of people died here where I'm standing right now, but in all of Nepal there were many, many thousand. I don't, I don't remember how many exactly. But uh, okay, uh, yeah, it's a sad sight, but you have to walk through it on your way up to the valley. So let's, uh, let's continue down. This is something else. Kyanjindri, you can see all the way, I think around that bend. Where I stayed, the village is right behind up there. Catching up whether they like it or not. It's a mother yak with her two calves. So she's not too impressed with Geraldo stalking him up the hill. Yeah, I'll let you know. 
leg broken? No. No? Just angry. Ooh, he's strong. Wow. That little bull is so strong. This country? Norway. Norway. Yeah. In Norway, no yak bull. <laughs> Where you take him? Go home? Yeah. So Kumar sent me this, he called me nine times yesterday and said, don't go mountain sar, anytime snowfall mountain up then down. Let's, I don't actually know what that means. So let's give him a call and figure this out, shall we? Come on, Kuma, the world is waiting. He just called me back. Hello. Hello, Kumar. Good morning, sir. You son of a gun, what's happening? You have a go, don't, don't go in mountain now, Ija. You tell me anytime snowfall mountain up and down. Not good time, sir. What does that mean? Yeah, yeah. Yesterday is a raining, then pro problem, then uh, it's no fall mountain down, then problem, sir. Okay. And? You have a good, good situation, then go up, sir. But you tell me not to go. Yeah. You want to look, then uh, sunrise, then you want to go, then not sunrise, then any time it uh, rain, then not go, sir. Okay, so the sunrise and then rain make it not good. Yeah, yeah. Ah, okay, okay. But I'm already in the mountain. Already mountain? Yeah, I'm in mountain now. Yeah, you have a... Uh, uh, today the, you have a down? Uh, yeah, I'm walking down now, yeah. Yeah, you... You have a very look down the mountain every... Every time it's, I don't know, then Isnopal Mountain is uh, then down. You know, you gonna look then down. Yeah, I'm looking in and down. Okay. Okay, sir. Have a nice day. Yeah, you too. Okay. <laughs> Stop calling me, sir. I told you. I'm gonna start calling you, Mr. President. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, Mr. President. See you in Kathmandu. Okay, sir. Okay. Have a nice day. Good day. Uh, okay, President. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. Uh, Kumar is so funny. Um, how long have I known him now? Two years? He insists on calling me sir. So I'm like, yeah. I told him last time, if you don't stop calling me sir, uh, I'm going to start calling you Mr. President because he's a little iffy about the president joke because he's worried about the actual president thinking that it's for real. Politics is a dangerous business in, uh, in Nepal. But anyway, uh, I think he was just, he was just, uh, if you're wondering what this is, I'm wearing this on my head for the sun. I don't have any sunscreen. Um, I think he was just worried that I'll get stuck up here or something like that. Anyway, let's continue. As I'm walking down here, basically everyone are like, Hey, I've seen you on YouTube. Can I have a photo? <laughs> you should have asked for a photo right here. Then you didn't have to run back. Okay. Here's a good photo with a good background. Okay. Like this? Okay? Sure. Let me see. Good one? Okay, have a good trip. Hope you find some water. <laughs> Their kettle was empty. No, as I'm making my way down here, old women, old dudes, the young people, everyone are saying, I've seen you on YouTube. 
and I'd say nine, 90% also say thank you for sending good message. They're uh, appreciative of the videos and that also means they're very appreciative of you guys because I've also met a lot of hikers uh, coming up here and they've also seen the videos and decided to come because of the video. Many of them, not every one, but uh, yeah. So if you have nothing to do and want a week-long adventure, come to Langtan and do this hike. <laughs> oh, they're catching up here. I'm too slow. Oh. You guys race ahead. <laughs> Ah, oh, hello! It's a big group! <laughs> I bet you none of them speak English, but I bet you they've actually seen the videos. It's really funny. Oh. It's funny, they are racing up and down here at probably twice the speed that I am. They're built for this though. Oh, hurry up! <laughs> Shabru? Yes, Shabru. As soon as you're out of the sun, or well, the sun is behind like some huge mountain top, it gets cold. I thought this forest was unreal the first time I walked through here, but now with the snow... Probably my two favorite things in this world, snow and forests. It's slippery here, so you gotta... Yeah, you gotta think as you're coming down here. I'm surfing! No. Yeah, I remember this cliff. This is the one that had uh, the landslide warning. Huh. Come to think of it, when you're standing here, it kind of looks like the hole that it kind of is leaning outwards. I don't know if you can see that in this wide angle lens, but it certainly looks like the whole cliff. It's coming out like that. Ooh, even bigger mountain up there. Yeah, this is where the landslide came from. Right up there, I assume. Hence all the boulders. Which make this river so scenic.
There's always more snow on that side of this gorge because the sun that's the path of the sun and kind of heats up this whole section whereas this section gets a bare minimum of sun this uh, this there's more forest on this side though because there's more rivers on that side strange ecosystem here Straight down here, as you can see the rubble I'm standing in right now. <laughs> They've been walking with him since I started. He's still angry. <laughs> oh man. Come on, be happy. <laughs> okay, good luck. Now I can go. Oh man. That thing does not... Does not want to go down with them. Oh. Oh. So angry. Good luck. Tashi Dele Kian Jingumpa Langtang Today is the Apro Besi? Okay. Good luck. Oh, it's coming with gas canisters. One of them is at least. Oh, wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Fourteen mules times. I assume each of them are probably carrying 50 kilos. I don't think there's a hundred on each, but if it's a hundred on each and there's 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, wow, we're talking 24 of them here. 24 times. $18, you do the maths. How much they're making if they bring in uh, uh, 25 kilos per mule or, or uh, oh man, there's even more and more. <laughs> Let's go down, because they were very afraid when I was standing here, the mules. Yeah, you guys do the maths. Let's say they have 30 mules. For food, yeah? Eating? Ah. All right. 
<laughs> well, you want money for food? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> uh, good luck. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> you know what? I just can't resist. Look how beautiful it is. This is the most. I've been looking for a natural pool like this. I can go in there, drift down there without there being any danger of me kind of continuing down. So I'm not feeling too hot at the moment, but let's go for it. I'll give you a point of view this time. I'll bring the camera in the water. Whoa. Hell yeah. Let's get naked. I'm trying to hurry because as long as I do this whilst the sun is shining, it's not that bad. Now granted, it's bad, but I can do it. Oh, 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 stones. Oh, oh, there's a beach. Oh, oh. But now we have to go in again. Okay, not a man unless you go under three times. Shrinkage. Oh. oh my god. Oh, so beautiful. Later, I, I actually felt for me like I was swimming for, I don't know, 20 meters? But I see now it's more like six and a half, and I'm being nice. <laughs> anyway, let's heat up. Riverside Cafe is right behind me. Let's go and say hello to the man. Uh, this valley's greatest uh, lumberjack. I'm back at the Riverside Cafe with, you remember the man who tried to teach me how to use the ax? Yeah. You remember? Yeah, I remember, I remember, for the wood. Yeah, I was very good or very yeah. bad? <laughs> good, good. I was good? Good, yeah. No, I was good. very bad. I, I, could, I couldn't do anything. Good, yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, you said, uh, how is business now? Not much, no people, no business. So it's about one month ago since I was here. Yeah, yeah. How many customers? No customers that not just Nepali few people, they stay in Lama Hotel and no drink tea. I see. Yeah. I remember when I, when I came back here, I think it was the 29th to 30th of December. I had a tea here on my way back as well and we laughed at, at me trying to cut the wood. Um, and he told me, a lot because Lama Hotel is so famous, a lot of these other places, yeah, yeah. It's not so famous like Lama Hotel. Yeah, Lama Hotel is, a, you know, the, the, the hotel, Eastern Place is came. Shabri Bensi to Lama Hotel, Kandin to Lama Hotel. So everybody's always Lama stopping Lama there. Hotel, yeah. So kind of guys like him who are... Uh, Lama Hotel is just like an hour there, yeah, right? Hour, yeah. So people already stop there, then they kind of wander past here. But uh, um, you told me last time there's only Nepalis going yeah, here now. Nepali, the Nepalis, the Eastern Lama Hotel, they are going for eating dal bhat, it's Borat Sabla Yeah. Here, 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 short way, you know? And also the tea is kind of like, tea in these places are obviously more expensive than Kathmandu. But, um, you know, my plea to those of you who can afford it, you know, stop at the... Um, one, of the one of the beauties of this whole hike and what makes it so unique, I think, is that there are so many of these places. So you don't really need to have a plan where you're going to stop. Um, but that will only continue to be the case if um, 
smaller places like this also makes money. So I mean, even if you already stayed at Lama Hotel, you're not thirsty, you know, stop by here, try the lemon tea, fresh squeezed lemon tea yeah. by your wife. Yeah. Uh, she's, where is she? Okay, she's, she's not on camera right now, but she, you know, they're good people, hardworking, they're always staying here. Even some of the other hotels, they're closed, they're leaving. You guys are always here, always right? Always here. You never leave. All here is open. So uh, yeah. yeah, try to give some business to, to, the, um, to the smaller um, um, establishments as well. You make the best tea? Yeah. Remember that guys, if you want uh, the fresh lemon tea, yeah. this is num number one. Yeah. There's number one, next time coming one day is the head, okay? Yes, the best place. Yeah. Okay, good luck. Yeah. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> the biggest selling point though, whilst I'm still here, with staying here is that they have the absolute best place for swimming in the river and it's kind of it has the river also has this turquoise beautiful color here and you can really you can go under here my problem like further up is that I can't really find the spot that I can really swim in because wherever it's deep enough for me to swim uh, the current is so strong I'm just gonna be swept uh, further down but right here that is not the case so uh, yeah, I even though I haven't stayed here myself Riverside Hotel. It's about an hour away from from Tibet uh, Cafe, which I'm gonna go to now with the with the Gongo brew master uh, Definitely if, if you don't stay here do stop by for, for some tea This has to be the tastiest tree because that is one bolt of yak is literally balancing on the edge of that cliff and I mean Hey there, tasty? Whoa, hey. That's no way to greet the Northman. Okay, I'll be on my way. You keep balancing and eating on that cliff. Ooh. Chow mein coming? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I am back, you remember this guy? The brewmaster. <laughs> How are you doing? Uh, tea. Tea, huh? Yeah. Oh, and more, uh, you still have some supplies, right? Yeah. I need another bottle. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone asked me like, whoa, is it really that good? And I said, <laughs> yes, it's the best. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just arrived here about 10 minutes ago, ordered a chow mein, met up with um, an Indian viewer actually, who decided to do this hike because of the video. So he's also going to have some chow mein. Yeah. Are these fresh vegetables from your garden? Yeah, garden. You grow this? Yeah. Where? The other side. On the other side? Yeah. I didn't know that. Ah, oh, here too. Is this also for the chow mein? Yeah, chow mein. Wow, this will be the freshest chow mein yeah, ever. Yeah, vegetable. Where, where do you grow it? Is it yeah, this right there? Greenhouse, small greenhouse. You have a greenhouse? Yeah. Can I go inside? Okay. Is it up behind there? Yeah, up this way. Let me greenhouse. see if I can find this. Wow, that is awesome. This is going to be, now his chow mein was also, it was already the best, but now I really know why. <laughs> what an awesome operation they're running here. Anyway, so this is actually, hold on, let me get back down here. Ooh, this is actually the fourth time I'm meeting them. I met them on the way back down the first time, late December. Then one of their... Uh, what's the name of your daughter again? Sonam. Sonam in Kathmandu. Kathmandu. She, the one who writes me on Instagram. That was Sonam, yeah? Sonam, yeah. Yeah, so Sonam, their daughter wrote me on Instagram. They were so happy with the video. They all watched it together. And they, you came to Kathmandu for New Kathmandu. Year's to yeah. see the daughter. So they invited me for dinner. Maybe I'll throw some pictures in. Right now we had dinner with Kumar. Yeah, Kumar. Funny yeah. man. <laughs> so. And then now I'm back here. Now it's the fourth time we meet. Yeah, fourth time. Wow, I'm so happy to see you again. Yeah, good to hear you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll leave you yeah. to it. I'll be inside. Famous people. <laughs> too much people. You, famous people. Well, now you're famous too. You. <laughs> <laughs> Have you had, how is business? You, any more no. customers coming or? No, no. Bad season? Yeah, half season. Okay. No. Hopefully March, yeah, yeah. April. Yeah. 
Oh, well, be the fresh chow mein. Okay, fresh chow mein. Okay, so good to be back. We're, uh, yeah, we're yeah. all gonna sample the local Cheers. brew. Cheers. Cheers! Okay. Okay. <laughs> good? Yeah, it's so smooth. Yeah. yeah. Very smooth, man. Yeah. Yak cheese from Kyanjin Gumpa. Yeah. Did, did, who made the cheese? Cheese, yeah. Who, who made it? Uh, by Yak Kyanjin Gumpa. Oh, you bought no. it? Yeah, yeah. Cheese factory, probably? Cheese factory. Yeah, yeah cheese they have one cheese factory there. Two, two months ago, I buy. Okay, okay. Yeah. And just eat it straight? Yeah, eat it. Okay, okay. okay. Put it in bread. When I am 100%, yeah, I will... Eat it. Yeah. Uh -huh. Awesome. Thank you so much. Okay. Maybe I'll try yeah. it with a uh, gone children. Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you take some photos? Yeah, come on, man. Okay. Well, guess we're signing off from here then. Bye-bye. Okay. Nice oh, to bye see bye. you again. Okay. Remember, stop yeah. stop by the Tibet guest house if you're on the, the Lang Tang hike. The, yeah, and you know what to do. You know what to drink. You know what to eat. Number one brewmaster. <laughs> yes, you approve? <laughs> yeah, approve. Ooh, there we go, the good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Yes. I've been looking forward to this my whole trip. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I ran back here. Yeah. For the best gongo and the best yeah. chow mein. Okay. We're almost here. You ready for pint with Gon Cholden? I'm ready, man. I'm waiting for it. You're gonna join? <laughs> yeah, man. Okay. He lives right up here. So literally, I think we just walked for maybe, what, 15 minutes? Probably, yeah. So, Let's very, do. very close to Lama Hotel. Oh, I'm loving the color schemes here, but this looks close. There's another one. Wow, that looks like someone actually built a proper mansion up on a hill. And now it's all, nature is reclaiming the land. Tashi Dele, how are you? <laughs> Is your I'm coming to see Gon Cholden. Yes. Is your your husband right? Yes. Yeah. I'm coming for a pint. <laughs> Actually, we're both coming for a pint. How's it going? <laughs> I'm okay. Yeah. Are you hanging out with Cholden? Sorry? Are you hanging out with children? Yes. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's free in the book. Nice and warm there. Awesome. Where did you just come from? Hey, how's it going? Tashi Dele. Gon children, how are you? Fine. <laughs> you know what I want? You know what I'm coming for? Okay. A pint. Fine. Yes. <laughs> ah. The whole world wants to see pints with children. <laughs> Be because, because from from my first video, can uh, I sit here? Yeah. Sit my here. first video, I ca I come up here at what seven in the morning. Uh, I'm tired. Usually at seven in the morning, people's like, "Hey, you want a tea?" But you told me, "Hey, you want a pint?" Uh, <laughs> so I figured, okay, now I will have a pint. Uh, what 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 is your beer? Do you have here? Beer, two borg. Two two borg, yeah. Two borg. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. One two borg for me. Yeah. Two borg for me. Too. One two borg for my friend. Yeah. Two borg for you? Yeah. Three? Two borg? No, thank you. <laughs> One, two, three. Four. Two borg. Four. Uh, Four. Four, Bjorn? Yeah. <laughs> one for you, one for him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he looks a bit shell shocked. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he was a gongo. <laughs> I'm not sure if you remember me or not. Been no. one, one, one month ago, yeah? Yeah. My can no, no is cool or can very, very English. Many no English. <laughs> Your English is quite yeah. good. The pint, that is a high class word. <laughs> you, you, you wouldn't learn pint like that's not the first word you learn. Sorry? Are you born here? Yeah, yeah. Your, your hometown is Kianjin or? My uh, <coughs> stay at my sister's lot. Oh. Sister lot. My belles can Lang Tang Hotel Marigold. Oh, Hotel Marigold. Oh, yeah, Marigold Lang Tang. Uh, that is a Lang Tang, okay. Because I met many people who know you. No. You, no, no, you have many friends. I uh, and and they tell me they that you live in Langtang. Yeah. Yeah. But you come here because the people who run the hotel are away holiday or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Less rambling, more uh, pinting. Yeah. Thank you so much.
I met, um, last time I was there, the family live in the tent. Uh, She's still there? This? You, no, you have a family live in a, in a tent with a yak bull. Yak boat? Yak boat? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Riverside. Uh, Riverside. Well, you ah, they go. Riverside. Ah, because uh, she asked me to buy socks for her. Uh, they are grinding their teeth just like uh, Don Jr., the goat in uh, Tanzania. Yeah. What's that? Sock. Sock? Uh, cold. Are you cold? Uh, ah. One in the chicklang sauce. You want socks? Uh, ah, you need new sock? All right. I will see if I can find you a new sock. Yeah. One chicklang. Yeah. The long one, yeah? Yeah, long like one. Like this? Cold. Okay. I will bring for you. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Come back and. I'm coming back, yeah. I'm coming back same way. Come back on, okay? Yes. I'll see you then. Bye bye. Bye. Yeah, reverse it. I can, yeah, I can just give to you then. Hold on. What are No, she wanted socks. If you mm -hmm. see her again. Uh, you know the lady? She live in the tent. The lady. Thank you, Daniela. She, she live in the tent uh, and she showed me her. Uh, she had some problem yeah, here. Problem, yeah, me give, okay? If you see her again, yeah. okay? Tomorrow, me, me, long, long go, I, me give, okay? Okay. Uh, yeah, thank you, Daniela. Yes, yes. All right, Skol, good to see you again. Yes. Yes. <laughs> and cheers to you too, Mr. Yes. No Tuborg man. No Tuborg. <laughs> I drink beer. I don't like beer. Too. Okay, so Goncholden is loosening up a little bit now. He's talking about how famous he is. Yeah. You, you said everyone watch you? Mm, my friend. Tomorrow morning, my friends and lemon tea. My can give. <laughs> but you say they see you on video. Many yeah. Nepali people. Uh, Nepali people and everything. Me living here. Me sister. Uh. Me children, daughter, son. So many look. They see you on the video. Uh, yeah. And, and what they think? They're saying like, why are you trying to sell pine to the foreigner? Uh. What? Good. Good. I friend. <laughs> I friend. <laughs> <laughs> so then, <laughs> You're a funny meme now on TikTok. There's like millions uh, of people. TikTok, because TikTok. because you uh. you call me like a funny name apparently in Nepali. They say it's like a a bad word. I'm uh, not going to repeat it. But poor people this after come and me living here this upset like we are ah sister bye. You TikTok me many. Look. Yeah, you're on TikTok <laughs> now. They don't watch on my channel. They're you're all on TikTok. Stop uh, ripping my content. <laughs> Stay on YouTube. Me uh, is very nice in English, no talking, and is little little um, small English talking, and in, in Nepali people, sister, sister, everything look TikTok. <laughs> okay. Number one TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah, house. Yeah. Lamba house. Ah, they put that on TikTok uh, too? The Lamba Yak house? Pass this, uh, uh, family. family sister. Ah. <laughs> All right. How, how does it feel to be famous? Famous. <laughs> children, family sister, famous, very famous. So children happy he's famous? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cheers to fame. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Here come my friend. Thank you so much. I will always remember. <laughs> if you guys are wondering why he is so famous here, um, let me show the, the. There's the TikTok meme. Yeah. Here, this was the this was the clip. My name is Goncholden. Goncholden. Nice to meet you. Yeah. My name is Ronaldo. Lado. Lado. We, we, we gotta take a look at the demo. This email my give, okay? Oh, you have email? Controlled. Nice yeah. to meet you. Yeah. My name is Ronaldo. Yeah. Lado. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he called me a dick and I said yes. Okay, okay. all good. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. And re remember, when you're coming through here, guys, to the head? business is tough here. Yeah, yeah, because okay. everyone going to Lama Hotel. It's just bamboo and llama, but yeah. Goncholden's place, what is the name here? Yeah. Uh, your name, Ramesh, the place? The Rimchi. Rimchi? Yeah, Rimchi. Everyone goes through here, but you know, um, stop stop here for a pint with Goncholden or a tea yeah, or some tea. food. Food. Okay. Cholden is always there. Me, Mary, 
Mary Gold. Mary Gold. In Langtang, your guest house is Mary Gold. Mary Gold, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So if you are not here, yeah. people can meet you in Mary Gold. Yeah, Mary Gold. Okay. Coming can Ganesh Himal, Ganesh Biu, or can Ganesh Rim to Ganesh Biu, or can Langtang, or can Langtang Marigold. Yes. Okay. Okay. You remember thinking, okay? I will remember. And yeah. everyone here will remember too. Yeah. Okay. They will come and have everything, a pint with you. Everything, <laughs> everything, everything, my lot, my lot, you know, children, you remember children, lot, okay? okay. Children. Yes. <laughs> my friend. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, man. Mr. Long told me. Yeah, told me. Can you take, can you take yeah. a photo of us? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, You're freezing. Daddy, 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 daddy. Thank, thank you so much. Thank bye. you. Thank you. Mm. Bye-bye. Ooh. Oh, next time come, Cholden on shoes, okay? Cholden, he wants yeah. new shoes. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. Uh, <laughs> on shoes, very nice shoes, okay? Oh my god, what you're right. Yeah. Okay. okay. You remember? You guys are probably going to be here before me, so you are going to get eternal gongo in the afterlife if you are the first man to bring on Cholden some shoes. Uh, okay? okay? What size are you? No, no. 39. 39. Yeah, 39. Okay, yeah. so uh, okay. 39, that's European uh, size. Yeah. Okay. Eternal gongo for whoever brings gone children shoes. Uh, yeah. You will have new shoes soon. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Many children, very problem on shoes. Gone children is a productive man. He has many children, they say. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, I will share you on my Instagram too if you bring gone children new shoes. So, some warm shoes, size 39. Yeah. Okay, see you then. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. Ah. Oh, they got some Korean customers too. That's nice. So, as I always say, the, uh, most people they stay at the same lodges because they're mentioned in guidebooks and uh, uh, you know itineraries from travel agencies. But you stop at these ones. Yeah. You, they, so they really appreciate you. You can have a pin with Mr. Long Children, man. Yes, and you're also really, really helping them out because times are very desperate up here. Now it's getting dark and we probably have an hour, and probably 30 minutes left of sunlight, but it's an hour and a half to bamboo. It's already 5.15, man. Let's speed up. Control in his pint, slowed us down. Another landslide area. And some of these rocks, they actually look quite fresh, especially the ones over there. So let's speed up past this area. And then from here on, this is the same area that I walked in the night, in my Himalayan night trek, that first time I went up. Uh, it's a bit more misty now, and it's, we probably have another five, ten minutes left of sunlight, and then it's gonna be another night trek. But at least this is an area I have walked through before, so no worries. And there's no ice or snow on the ground here, so it shouldn't be a problem. This turned into another night hike, but we're almost there. What time is it? It's around probably 6.30. 6.30. Hey, not too bad. Good morning from Bamboo. Yes. Look who's here. Hey, you're running away. <laughs> Hello. You want to do some vlogging? Yes. You were natural. Here, go vlog your, your friends. They're doing TikTok videos, right? Yeah. First of all, before you start your vlog, what's it like to be famous? <laughs> I'm very shy. <laughs> and very funny. So everyone recognize you now? Yeah. yeah? What do they say? Um, hi, hello. Hello. I see your video. And everyone call me, my before friends. They call you? Yeah. Do you have many? Uh, because my, everyone in my comment section, you say you want to marry her. No. You know what? I have very bad news. You are already married, right? Yes. All right. So if anyone wants to marry you, the answer is no. No. All right. I don't say nothing. You say nothing? Yeah. Only I... Haha. <laughs> Just laughing? Yes. 
You remember the first time you took the camera, you said, hey, I'm Jane, <laughs> yeah. I'm vlogging. Actually, my name is Surjay. Surjay? Yes, and I like to call only Jay. I think Jay is fine. Yeah. Here, go vlog, vlog the TikTok. Okay. <laughs> please visit Bamboo Lodge. It's a very good, beautiful place. Okay, one second. How's your vlog going? Good. Yeah? You don't, I don't, you don't seem to be very interactive. You're not talking a lot in your vlog. This time I am talking in Nepali. You're talking in Nepali? <laughs> Where is your friend? I don't know, I don't know. All right, guys, as you can see, ba ba Bamboo is back in business. Have you had many customers coming since last time? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, 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 after your video. They're coming from the video? Yeah, yeah. Okay, and you are looking to expand. You told me you're going to build one cabin up there yeah. and then another one up there. So you're going to have more rooms. Yeah. When are they going to be ready? Uh, it's uh, probably March and April. March and April? Yeah. <laughs> I have to practice then I You have to practice, okay. We have hotel in Bamboo Lodge. If you want to come in Long Town then please visit our hotel. Our hotel name is Bamboo Lodge. And if you want then we will tell how <laughs> That was great. Harold approves of that pitch. Come to Bamboo Lodge everyone. That was good. Not not can you edit that? I will get Can I edit that? I don't edit. Cut <laughs> <laughs> that, God, I will tell you. Or God. <laughs> okay, we'll cut that, we do it again. Yeah. All right, you ready? No, no. I'm practicing. Mm. Lodge. That was good. I'm practicing. Oh, I'm getting nervous. <laughs> <laughs> You're a natural, there's nothing to be nervous about. Today. <laughs> <laughs> Wi-Fi King, do you want to help her out? That's all? Do you want to help her out with the video? She's nervous alone. I don't know what to say. You can talk about your Wi-Fi. Okay, I'm ready. You ready? Yeah. I'm... <clears throat> do I look pretty? <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah. <clears throat> Start. One, two, three, catch up. Namaste people, if you want to come long time then do visit our hotel Bamboo Lodge. We have good accommodation and facilities. Thank you. You heard the lady, Harold approves of Bamboo Lodge. Come to visit. Come visit. Bamboo Lodge. Bamboo Lodge. Bamboo Lodge, yay. That was great. Thank you. Look at Jane re replying to all her fans. <laughs> How many messages today? Today? Yeah. Today, no. No Before messages. Before many messages. Everyone uh, send me link, video link. To the video. And this Your is video. you, you, you. Mm. Everyone asked me. And, and okay, so for those, for those of you who asked, the translations with Yaya were 110% correct, right? Yeah. My translations was good. Yes, yes. So Yaya, she, what I put on the screen was right. Yeah. Yeah? Okay, so there you have it. Don't question my subtitles ever again. <laughs> yes. Why are you laughing? You're, now you're acting like my subtitles are not real. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what, what did she say? What, what did she really say? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, like you, Monica, to you. Uh, how are you? Who are you? Uh, who are you? She said, who are you? Uh, who I am. And so why did she not know who you are? Uh, she didn't see very well. So but even though you were very close, like you were literally like right to her face, you were telling your name. Yes. And, and not who you... my name. I Mr. she don't know my Mr. name also. No. I say my husband's name. Your husband's name. Yes. And your father's name as well. No. Just a husband. She know my husband well. And then she know who you are. Yes. And I say I am Lofsang wife. Uh, I am came from Shabrubensi, like this. And then she not ask about me at all. Uh, ask. She don't ask. Uh, auntie asks you. 
<laughs> and did she call me an albino or not? <laughs> what what did she call me? She called me like a foreigner or? Yes, foreign. Foreigner, yeah. okay. All right, you see my subtitles were somewhat accurate. Yeah. Everyone say very funny. <laughs> that you funny? Yes. And someone say uh, your English is, I think, better, but you are very loose English talking. Your English? Uh, uh, yes. Okay. That's why they want to see you again. Who's vlogging? Turn the camera. I am Jay. With many friends. Oh, we just passed Yaya's house. And now we have a new guide. The car is waiting for us. And this man's going to show us the way. Do you know where the car is? Yes. What's your name? Anistama. Anistama? Yes. And you are a subscriber, you said? Yes. And he hit the bell button. He knows what to do as a subscriber. I'll follow in your footsteps so I don't get muddy shoes. Which path would you recommend for the Northmen? Hey, we made it! Hey, thank you so much. You led the way. He's my, you are very fan. He's my number one fan. He said, "Yeah." Wow. Well, now, now he's also the number one guide in, in Himalaya because he helped us find the car. So, how are you going to go back home? Are you going to Siapru? Yes. Or are you going to the bamboo? No, no in Siapru. Oh, he's coming with us. Oh, okay, jump yeah. in then. Yeah, you can be up front. You be up front. Whoopsie. You got, yeah, I'll jump in first. Shortcut. Oh. And we are stuck. Nope. We're taking a new road. Apparently we're gonna save an hour by taking this road. Uh -huh. uh, the only downside to this uh, shortcut is that it's gonna be horrible for what? A couple hours? One hour maybe. Okay. But apparently then it ends up in a better road. <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> uh. Actually, it's not that much worse. The other one too is horrible. This happened the last time. I took a jeep to Kathmandu as well. We got stuck. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> hey. Nice, nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Yeah, I was hoping to meet you in Langtang, but... Ah, uh, okay. Instead, I get stuck here. <laughs> uh. All right. Now, uh, yeah, last time it took an hour and a half to get out of this. Right here now, I don't know what the problem is. Destroying his tires. You're burning the tire. Okay, we aborted mission. What a disaster. Anyway, you probably, I, I mean, it was a major. I knew this was gonna happen. Last time I took the Jeep here as well. My idea was that I was gonna save time and that the Jeep would be faster than, uh, than the bus. I was yeah. wrong. It took eight hours. We drove, first thing he did was to drive off the road. It spent an hour and a half getting loose. And then, you know, just, he didn't know how to drive and yeah, I guess we just probably have another I hour mean, to hike back then. I mean, he's not from around here, but no. he, has much, he doesn't have much experience of driving here. No, he doesn't have much experience of driving at all. But anyway, I guess we're on another hike then, back to where we came from. And uh, maybe hitch a ride to some other town, yeah. a little closer to Kathmandu. Dunche, Dunche probably. Yeah. Okay. Oh, man.
this is such a scenic spot, so I decided to sit here and just take in a moment. And then it uh, started to hail from below. So now it looks even better than, uh, than when I sat down.